Hi, thanks for watching this video. My name is James and I'm a lighting designer. I want to do a little comparison between some conventional fixtures and an LED fixture. The first fixture we'll talk about is the Altman 65Q for now. For testing purposes, it's got a 500 watt lamp in it. The second fixture is a Philips Selectcon Pacific 50 degree ellipsoidal with a 575 watt lamp in it. And the LED we're talking about is a PAR I bought online. It's got 18 15 watt LEDs, they're RGBAW. The first thing we're going to see is the white from the Altman 65Q Fresnel, which I metered on this 10 foot throw at about 100 foot candles. The second thing we're looking at now is the Philips ellipsoidal with a 575, and I measured it at about 180 foot candles on that 10 foot throw. This is the LED fixture with all five colors on for white and I measured it at 190. It's obviously a brighter white probably more in the 5600 Kelvin range versus the roughly 3000 Kelvin range of the Fresnel and the ellipsoidal. The second thing we're doing is comparing red. The gel in the ellipsoidal and the Fresnel is R26. The Fresnel measured about 17 foot candles here you can see the red in the Leco. It measures about 25 foot candles on this 10 foot throw on this white drape. You can see here the red from the LED is a little more vivid than the R26 and it measures about 25 foot candles as well. This is the Roscoe 91 uh, in the Fresnel which only measured at about 7 foot candles on that 10 foot throw. This is the same Roscoe 91 in the ellipsoidal and it measured about 8. This was the green off the LED which measured at 80 foot candles. Much brighter and a more vivid green. Blue we kind of find the same thing. This is R80. In the Fresnel it only measured about 7 foot candles. Then we get the ellipsoidal, which measured a little bit brighter. It only measured at 8 foot candles. Finally, we get the LED, which was significantly brighter to the eye, but only measured at about 4 foot candles. But I think it's because it's probably a little closer to the UV end of the scale. That's just my comparison, my thoughts about the three and what I saw when I measured it and looked at it. And you can see from the video the LED does seem to be just a little bit brighter all the way across the board and the covers seem to be a little more vivid. So I think it is a reasonable assumption that you can replace some of your conventional fixtures with LEDs and not be lacking in brightness if you get something with bright enough LEDs in it.